Hi, I'm Aaron Graber, and today we're going to install the new Ventrac slope gauge on a 4500 tractor. To install a slope gauge, you'll need installation instructions, a utility knife, a 7 16 wrench, the slope gauge, and the installation harness. Once you have all the supplies, you'll raise the hood, you'll remove the radiator screen to allow more space to work, then you'll pop the plug out of the dash and take the two screws loose that hold the TCM on. We set the TCM out of the way, install the slope gauge into the dash, and use the wiring harness to connect everything. After that, you'll reverse the process, and you'll be done. It should take about 10 to 15 minutes to complete this job. The first step is to lift up the hood, then remove the radiator screen. Next, remove the plug in the dash. The next step is to use the utility knife to cut this vinyl away where there's metal notches. So the trick here is to push the vinyl down, just kind of depress it into the metal, and it'll leave an imprint of where that notch is so that you know where to cut. And you're just going to come in here, and you're going to take a blade, and you're going to make two slices and just clean that out a little bit so that the gauge has a better place to sit. Now you can see after using the utility knife, we have a much cleaner notch here for the gauge to sit in. Next, you're going to loosen the two bolts on the bracket that holds the TCM. Don't remove these bolts entirely because if you do, then it'll be more challenging to put it back together. So remove them just enough to slide this bracket off and move it away. Now move the TCM off to the side. The next step is to slide the slope gauge into the dash. Now locate the plug that has the black, orange, pink, and wires heading to it. Remove the cap and install the wiring harness onto that plug. Then take the other part of the wiring harness and install it to the slope gauge. Route the slope gauge wiring harness up and around the hydraulic fluid reservoir and connect the pink wire from the audible alarm into the terminal on the harness. Then connect the blue connector back to the audible alarm. Now you put the TCM bracket back on. Reinsert the radiator screen, close the hood, and buckle the latches. Once the slope gauge and wire harness are installed, the final step is to raise the seat, pop the cap off the fuse box, locate the number 5 slot on the fuse block, and insert it there. When you turn the key on, the slope gauge is going to use the audible alarm to tell you that it's off. So you actually have to calibrate it once you install it initially onto the tractor. Ventrac, your one tractor solution. Watch more of Ventrac in action by clicking on a link below or subscribe to our channel and get the newest video releases.